So you can always message us at Ben and Kelly show. We spoke to Paul yesterday. If uh, you'll recall, he had an issue with his girlfriend's ex-boyfriend in his own words. She has an ex that she dated for a while and he's coming into town and he's going to stay with her for a week. And I'm not cool with that. So I don't know if I'm overreacting if I have anything to worry about if anybody else maybe I'm the only one that doesn't you know hang out with their exes I don't know but it's it's driving me nuts yeah so we had plenty of people that were like whoa red flag red flag red red flag yeah and- like nobody was really on board with this idea in fact I think the best ideas we had tossed out there was okay let the boyfriend stay in her apartment she comes stays with you Yeah, so that was kind of what we all settled on. Now, there were a few listeners that uh, it was fine, and they're like, look, if you've got trust and everything is good, then shouldn't be a big deal. Um, And there was like a six-year timeline here. They've been broken up. mm -hmm. He lives out of town. So, But still, I think for everyone to feel comfortable, and that's really what it was about, Paul doesn't feel comfortable with it. Right. So that really should trump everything else. So we got a message this morning from Paul. Uh, he writes, I did it. I just texted my girlfriend about this situation with her ex. I was full of confidence, nerves, and adrenaline all at the same time, thanks to you all. I told her that I felt uncomfortable with her ex coming to stay with her for the week and suggested she stay with me and he could use her place. Was she, that she ha- record mice? She hasn't replied back yet, but I'll let you know what she says. Thanks. So I replied back to him. That's great. And I think the right move. Let us know, and good luck. And so I just got a message a couple minutes ago from Paul again. Hang on, she just texted me back, and it doesn't look good. What? She what? said... Like, oh, she, wait, I'm starting to get angry. She said she doesn't know and isn't sure our relationship is ready for that. All caps. What does that mean? I'm sorry, back the truck up, back, 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 okay, back, hang back on the a second. truck up. So, Her relationship isn't... Like at the place where she can stay with Paul, but an ex but can the stay. Ex can okay. Exactly. So wait, wait, wait. What what should we write back to Paul? Because because I, this is real time right now. Yeah. So wait a minute. How long has Paul and her been dating again? Uh, he said he just said a while. Been a dating while. a while. Okay. Uh, well, okay. So so I guess the I, fact that she is oh more gosh. comfortable staying with her ex we, than her current boyfriend. Yeah, that's a red flag. Troubling. So let me write back to. Paul here. I feel like we need to be his counselor. Like, how do you feel about that, Paul? <laughs> well, I don't. I mean, I because I feel offended. I'm offended. Do Do you think that's what he should write? I, say, I say, I'm, I'm a little. Like, um, I'm confused. Okay, so uh, hang on. I'm, I'm your I'm, current I'm... boyfriend, and you're uncomfortable staying with me. Okay, but your ex boyfriend totally fine. All right, so Literally I'm text, write that. I, I'm writing him right now. Whoa, red flag. Uh, say I'm confused. And what'd you say? I'm confused. Yes, I'm I'm confused. So you're uncomfortable staying with your current boyfriend, Uncom- but the ex boyfriend totally fine. Okay, so you're question uncomfortable. Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. With maybe an exclamation mark. Your <laughs> current boyfriend, but you're fine with the hairs on the back of my neck are sticking out right now. Okay. Like with, saying, hmm, she's uh, thinking something might happen with the ex-boyfriend if this is the way she's going. Staying with you? The, oh, question oh, Adriana, mark, so question stop. Mark. This is a conversation, not a text. She question wants us mark. to, like, call him. <laughs> I know. I was going to say, this needs to be a phone call. Like, what? It, okay, so, all right, I hit, right now? I hit send. I hit send. So, wow, Ooh, that is. We should just do a three-way call. Just get her on the phone, too. Let's work it all out. Uh, Ga- I have questions. Gary texts in and says, screw her. Get out of there, Paul. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. I've choked on my shake. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Mike. Uh, drop her like a hot rock. Punt her for field wow. goal. Uh, like oh, oh. Liz this texted. went from red flag to yes. burning flag fast, said Liz. <laughs> yes, yes. All right, all right, all right. Oh, wow. Yeah, no, uh, I'm so, upset. So, yeah, Listen, Paul, wait, the fact on. that she, she, there shouldn't be any sort of hesitation on her part in this scenario. Like, no, no, there you shouldn't. You current boyfriend over ex-boyfriend all day long. Why is this a thing? Okay, so Paul, Paul just wrote back to me and said, uh, I... Uh, 
okay, I just texted that to her. Okay. Oh, okay. this is, I mean, are we just supposed to sit here and wait for a reply? <laughs> It's this Kelly, happening I, in real life. I mean, this is so real hard. time. Okay. All right. So, um, all right. So I tell you what, I tell you what, I tell you what, um, we're totally programming I, the station for Paul. I know. Right I know. All right. So hang out, hang out just a second. Let, let me, let me get a couple oh. more like, uh, exchanges with Paul under our belt. And then, and then we'll, I got to go walk around a little bit and blow off some steam. <laughs> I'm, I'm upset. And we'll get, and, and I, I promise as long as he keeps communicating with us, I'll have another update for you. Coming up here next. Not to bring you along on this wild, wild update that we have been um, dealing with real time, um, but to catch you up, Paul, his girlfriend is friends with her ex-boyfriend who they broke up six years ago. He's coming into town. She agreed to stay at her place to allow him to stay at her place. Paul's all like, I'm not cool with this. Yeah. And so... We got an update early this morning where he texted her that, hey, um, why don't you stay with me? And he, meaning her ex, could use her place. And so that th- was a suggestion that we kind of landed on yesterday. We, we thought, yeah, that's the best course. He took our advice and we were hoping for good things. Yeah. And then we got a message back from Paul who said that she had texted him back and said, that she doesn't know if that's a great idea and isn't sure our relationship is ready for that and is all like, all caps, what does that mean? And so then we started down this wild, like, holy cow, this is happening in real time. Yeah, I can't believe she's pushing back on that. Like, why are you more comfortable staying with your ex-boyfriend than with your current boyfriend? And that's what we, that was, that was where we left it, right? Because I, I, we did get a, a couple more exchanges here. 842, we got a message from Paul back. She wrote back, and this is in response to what we had him write her, which was the, I'm confused, so you're uncomfortable staying with your current boyfriend, but you're fine with your ex staying with you? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Yeah, 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 yeah. So she wrote back, I can't believe you don't trust me. What is our relationship if it's not built on trust? And so she is trying to put it back on him. We messaged him back, was like, you have got to... (laughs) <laughs> you have got to respond to this. I just wrote back and said, call her. Um, yes, this is a conversation that needs to happen. Yeah. And I would like to listen in. I know. I was going to say, and, and then call us. Uh, eight, 846, Paul wrote back and said, I tried calling her and it got sent to voicemail. Oh, wow. I okay, am so, upset. Okay, 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 I'm okay. Upset. Okay, so let's, okay, so if we tell Paul... What if he just shows up unannounced? Like, like say, hey, are you fine with me then showing up unannounced? Yeah. Is that, I, I, I right, feel right, like, yes. All right, all right let, me, I, let me write that I, real quick. Well, okay, let me write that real quick. You know what? Wait, 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 wait a second. Wait let a second. She turned it back on him, right? So he needs to turn it back on her. Say, hey, put yourself in my shoes. What if my ex-girlfriend was going to come stay with me? All right, that's good. How would that's you good. feel? Go, go slower. Golly. Put yourself. And now I had I had already written him and said, uh, "Hey, tell her if you're fine if I just show up unannounced." Um, but then, but then, and and, hang on, put, yeah, your, put, put yourself, put yourself in, my, in shoes. my shoes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put yourself in my shoes. Then. Okay. <clears throat> God, it's about good. respecting boundaries. That's good too. Yeah, you gotta you, you gotta give it to me all in one one thing. I can't write. I can't type that fast. I can't type that fast. <laughs> oh my I'm gosh! Just, I'm, I'm really sweating. perplexed as to how she doesn't understand his point of view with the situation. Yeah. You know what that smells like? That smells like she wants to hook up with her ex. There's something. Um, okay, hang on. He's he's. I, I see the little dots on the messenger. So he's writing. This back. is crazy. Uh, <laughs> By the way, Mike is still saying, punt her for a field goal. <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> uh, like, there's so many people that are just like, you know what? I'm out. We're breaking up with her right now. Okay, so Paul wrote, 
Um, I tried calling her and it got sent to voicemail. Okay, yeah, 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 we got that. Um, sorry. Uh, she wrote, sorry, I'm at work and can't talk about this right now. I'm, mm-hmm. I'm so sick. I thought we were stronger than this. You're so insecure and I'm not having this conversation right now. I don't know how many times I have to tell you you have nothing to worry about. She thought they were stronger than that, and then yet she's not comfortable staying with him. And then he put a bunch of question mark, question mark, question mark, like like he's like, and then mind blown, mind blown, mind blown. Oh man, this doesn't look good. Yeah, this shouldn't even be a conversation. This, look this good. literally should not have been a conversation. This shouldn't have even been something he needed to write us about. Yeah, so she uh, should have been like, oh babe, I get it. Yeah, text from a listener. Uh, she's already made up her mind and is just trying to make it his fault, so she isn't the bad guy. True, Man. true statement. Okay. Ooh, I don't see a future with this because this is this is not respectful no. of Paul and his feelings. No, one hundred percent not. Just that in and of itself is that she keeps you know she's refusing to see that point of view, his point of view. If I, I'm, I'm, I'm writing, hang on, troublesome. If, if she's refusing to see your point of view and respect it, hang on, and respect it, that's. Troublesome. Okay. Yes, that is troubling. Troubling or troublesome? Like, I'm getting ready to hit send. Um, <laughs> troubling. 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 Right, troubling. troubling. Yes. Troubling. It's so hard for me to type <laughs> while you're trying to dictate what I'm trying to say. This oh is so God. wild. All right, all right, all right. All what right, other right. show does this? I don't know. Where I, we just sit here and, and wait for conversations to happen between a couple. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. Gary, is this how couples therapy works? Gary says she wants to have her cake and eat it, too. If they're yeah, stronger no. than that, she should be okay staying with Paul. Amen. Yes. Uh, well, yeah, I'm really confused as to why her comfort level isn't there with her current boyfriend, but super there with the ex. Mm. Really? Mm-mm. Yeah. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, I don't know. We we may we may need even a third update from this, but I don't know. This is uh, so this is uh, I, I think we're relieving it for now. Listen, at this point, the only update I want is that he has that, dumped her. That's I know it seems savage I, and harsh uh, coming is. from me. I am a romantic, but I am angry at her lack of respect for Paul. I have an allegiance with Paul. I do. No, I, we can't suggest that to him. I like. Well, I, I can't text that to him, right? Yeah, it'd be a little harsh. Saying yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. I'm not going to do this. But th- this is seriously d- like long term. Yeah, long term. I don't, I don't think see a that this, this situation is setting them up to have success in the future. It's funny you say that. Uh, Paul just got back to us and said. Uh, I know, I think the writing's on the wall with this one, period. Okay, so he, he sees it. I think he does. Dang. He's starting to see it. And it's tough when you when you have feelings for this person. I know. To kind of see it for what it is, but it's real obvious to us what's happening. Oh, my gosh. Okay. All right. Well, if she wants and to I'm have... Upset. If she wants to have her cake and eat it, too, if she wants to... She's not going to get it. And then if, if she thinks that she can have a better relationship with an ex that she hasn't seen in six years... Or maybe, maybe not. Maybe they have been seeing each other this entire time. Maybe, Who knows? Maybe. Listen, all I know is she's disrespecting our Paul. <laughs> no, I know. And I, feel, <laughs> I feel a connection to Paul now. I feel really personally offended by it. Paul's like our little brother that just needs some help. <laughs> Dang it, Paul. There's better. There's more fish in the sea for you, buddy. We will be there for you, Paul. Uh, yeah. All right. Do what Kelly does. Get your crying rug out. Have some Arbor Mist. Drink a beer with your friend. And then, uh, and man, just, just, just move on. Yeah. All right. Hey, thank you. If you want to hear the original phone call and all that, if you want to chime in on anything, you can. What a wild ride this has been the I'm past to go 20 minutes. I'm real fired up. I know. Um, at Ben and Kelly show.